So let's say we go num equals 10. Okay, that's great. Num plus 2 works perfectly, right? But now you turn around and you go, hey, here's my number of open ports on the system and the doggone thing blows up. Okay, now what we got to do is we got to go, hey, num actually equals 18 like this. Okay, now can someone tell me why this works now? Why does this work now? Hmm? Both are strings now, right. So this whole thing is a string, and you combine it with this. That is now a string. Okay, so that's one way to solve the problem. Now I'm teaching you this because the two biggest errors that I see are people who don't nest quotes properly. So let's say I go, right, example, right, left parent, right parent, left arrow, right? Double quote, double quote, left arrow, right? Uh, left parent, right parent, uh, single quote, single quote, uh, left bracket, right bracket, right? In all these cases, right, left squiggly, right squiggly, in all these cases, you find people, since they don't get into that left arrow, Double quote, double quote, left arrow. Single quote, single quote, left arrow. Left bracket, right bracket, right ar left arrow. If people don't get into that habit, they start to mess up nested stuff like this. They start to mess up this kind of stuff. Okay, so that's the first big issue that I see with new newbies in the language. The second issue is concatenating strings together. So I used to do stuff like this. I used to do stuff like this. Subnet equals uh, like this. 182.168.0 period. And then I would do octet equals 10. I try to do subnet plus octet. Okay. Why does that not work? Right. Octet is an integer. Subnet's a string. So what I could do is I could go to octet and I could turn it into a what, guys? Right, I could turn it into a string. Now I can concatenate them suckers together. Okay? And this used to happen to me on pen test. I'd be out trying to make IP lists and stuff like that. And them suckers just would not work. 